Our news continues at 430 here on Channel 3, and as we mentioned, about half of Georgia's population is fully vaccinated. But in northwest Georgia, our part of the world, the COVID vaccination rate is much lower. Angela Kim has the story. We currently have in our 10 northwest Georgia counties about 36 percent of our total uh, population fully vaccinated. That is well below the state average. Logan Boss at the Georgia Health Department is encouraging people to get vaccinated and if you are vaccinated to get a booster shot. We're seeing that a lot of people still uh, seem to believe for some reason that the flu vaccine and the COVID vaccine are mixed together. And there is absolutely no truth to that. He says with people hitting the road this holiday season, the department is predicting a rise in cases coming with the start of the new year. Everything from uh, people being indoors in places like churches where they're singing and holiday parties, we, we certainly anticipate to see a, 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 some sort of spike. He says there are some simple ways to prevent this rise, like physical distancing, wearing a mask, and getting a rapid test done before visiting others. See that you or your host uh, at a gathering, practice ventilation. Crack those windows, even if it's a little bit cold outside. He says at the end of the day, vaccines will be the biggest asset to anyone, especially as the Omicron variant is spreading through the U.S. with limited information about it. The main thing that we've got going for us this holiday season compared to last, last holiday season is, is that we've had a year of getting these wonderful and very safe vaccines. Reporting in Northwest Georgia, Angela Kim, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thanks, Angela. The department hopes to eventually offer free rapid tests through local health departments for those who don't have insurance.